I'm just going to go over a few panel applets I found. Uh, this first one here is called Desk Bar. And this one acts a lot like Gnome Do if you've never used that. Um, what it does is it lets you uh, search for things. Um, so all you have to do is the Alt and F3. And you can basically search for any place on your computer. Um, application. Anything. And you can just hit enter. And whatever it is you select uh, will open up. And if you actually uh, right click in here, there's some preferences. Um, I just uh, did the Twitter one right here. And um, there's a few other ones. You got the dictionary, uh, the Google search, Tomboy. There's a few of them. Um, there's not as many as Gnome do, that's for sure. Um, but to give you an example of the Twitter one, all you have to do is um, just type something. Um, let's just say test. And you want to make sure you highlight Twitter and hit enter. And if I go to my Twitter here, yeah, you can see there it is. Uh, so that's pretty cool. Um, so that's pretty much it for that one. It's just good for searching for things. Um, yeah. Uh, the second one here is called Launchers List. And this one, um, I like this one because you can customize your launchers. Because uh, usually what people do is if they want to add a launcher, uh, they usually just um, take it and drag it to the panel. Uh, that's all good, but if you want to maybe make them compact and put more on the panel, um, all you have to do is go into preferences here. Whoops. And just you can add them in from the men from the menu. Um, just check off whatever ones you want. Um, when you're done, just click add, and there they are. And you can change the number number of uh, rows and columns too, if you want. Um, so yeah, that's that's pretty cool. Uh, so I can make it really small if I want to, but. I don't know why I do that. Um, and you can move them around in here, uh, whatever order you want, doesn't matter. And um, if you want to add something in that's maybe not in the menu, I don't know why it wouldn't be. <laughs> or if you just want to do it manually, which would be harder, uh, you can do new launcher and click OK. And basically just click properties. And uh, to find the application, you just uh, right click on the menu here the edit menus and find whatever it is you want um, and just hit properties and copy everything from this box here into that box uh, I don't know why you did why you'd want to do that but they, they made it easy for you so you can just um, so you can just do it from the menu uh, so that may, that's pretty cool um, and that's pretty much it for that one. I like this because as you can see, you can fit lots of them in here uh, without any problem. And it doesn't take up that much space either. Um, so yeah. And the last one, this is pretty cool. It's the CPU Fire applet. Uh, you can't really change anything. Or yeah, you can. Uh, I guess it's not opening up. Um, so you can't change anything, but it'll just take you to your system monitor uh, where you can view everything. And uh, yeah, so I think it looks pretty cool. This is another one I was using, um, a bubble applet right here. Uh, that's pretty neat. Um, I might just swap that now, see how that looks. Um, so yeah, that's it for those. I thought they were pretty cool, so uh, go check them out, and that's it.